Hello everybody and welcome to Thankful Thursdays. I know this probably isn't even going to come out on a Thursday, but it's Thursday, Thanksgiving Thursday when I'm filming this, so now it is. I know I've been on a long sabbatical of sorts, but I do have no excuse. I've taken 8 months out of my life not doing YouTube, even though YouTube is one of my passions, not exactly getting big on it, but exercising this creativity, and I've tried to make certain vlogs, and I've tried to make certain videos, and I just haven't posted anything or edited anything out of a, a loss of energy for it, and I think that it was uncalled for. Every time I'd look back at a video, I'd think, this isn't what I want to make. I'd look back at a certain vlog I made, and I'd say, I don't want to post this because I feel like it's not going to be good enough. I feel like the content isn't good enough. And that's when I came to the realization, looking back at all those videos, that they can be good enough. And that's what this video is for. I look back at the footage and I realize that each individual video wasn't exactly everything I strived to make it, but maybe together they can be something. So maybe as you can tell from my swollen face, I got my wisdom teeth out yesterday. And I thought it was going to be way different of an experience than it was, but I think, I think that's okay. You'll see. I woke up in the morning of the surgery at peace. A piece that I wasn't gonna die, not really a piece of mind that I wasn't gonna say anything stupid because I was the most terrified of that. I thought I might say something that'll ruin my entire existence in this family. Or I could say something hilarious that will go on the internet, maybe one hand in hand. Either way, I figured this was gonna be a good vlog. On the way to the surgeon, I learned two things. One, that we were not going to be able to film inside the doctor's office, and two, that I'm actually not that bad at parking. But let's focus on the first thing. There's really no transition to the moment when I get my wisdom teeth out or during the surgery at all. Basically, I just asked my sister to film when I was in the car and whatever happened, so let's just skip the boring car ride and get to the moment where the doctor or the nurse brings me out into the car and we see what the results of the surgery were. Not embarrassing, like all of us were hoping. Uh, <laughs> He's disappointed. I'm disappointed because I'm not as loopy as I thought I was going to be. I remember, I remember everything. <laughs> Maybe I won't remember this, but I doubt it. Listen guys, I thought I was gonna be loopy and I was like, this is gonna be the best YouTube video of all time. This is the best comeback for me to come back uh, for like five months I've been gone. And I'm not. So I'm gonna click, click bait the crap out of this to make people click on it. But, and I'm gonna say, not click bait. I went insane. But I didn't. So, it prank you. It's a good prank, Colin. It's, really it's a really good prank. Oh, and I got my teeth, oh, no. but I will not show you because that's gross. That's disgusting. That's pretty gross. That's pretty gnarly, bro. Not really isn't even a real word. I'm pretty sure it was just. Not because there's so much blood on your teeth. It's just. I don't know what to do about it. I can't. No, see. just don't talk anymore, or else your gauze is gonna fall off. I can't help it. I love talking. That's my favorite. God, that is disgusting. Maybe I was higher than I thought I was. I looked back at this and I thought for sure I was done trying to vlog. Third attempt, and I still didn't get the vlog I wanted. I looked back at the footage and I realized I was looking at this all wrong though. I was trying to make this about the YouTube aspect, about making money and getting views, when really, it showed me something greater. It showed me that I'm thankful for things. The fact that I have the health and the financial security to get a surgery like this in the beautiful state that I get to do it in was the real reward of filming this. It reminded me about what was so great about my last vlog, the one I never posted from the Balloon Fiesta. The reason I got in the Balloon Fiesta for free in the first place was because my mom was working in it. My dad pays for us to live in a place like this, and sure it has flaws, the crime rates are nothing to brag about, but being able to hang out with some of my best friends reminded me of why I'm thankful to live here. Obviously, where I live is how I met the friends of mine that I have in the first place, but the beautiful opportunities that I get here that bring a connection to my friends that I couldn't really have anywhere else is amazing. Even though I did no actual talking in this vlog of the Balloon Fiesta, I don't think that was ever really the point. 
Where I live is how, my friends. One gives me the opportunity to grow the other. So, Julia, I thank you for this vlog. And that brings us to the hike. The first vlog I ever tried to make and failed. I'm thankful for my financial security, and I'm thankful for my health, and I'm thankful for uh, where I live, but mostly, I'm thankful for my friends and family. And I think that the last part of this vlog displays that perfectly. As we made our way up the mountain, I learned how people other than myself act in front of a camera. The change in perspective to capturing others was honestly odd for me. Why? You guys are terrible on camera. What? You guys are terrible on camera, all you do is wave. <laughs> What am I supposed to do? Should I ask? <clears throat> I think I'm good. Not to say that I've ever been the best in front of the camera, but at <laughs> least we all tried. <laughs> Hands up, what kind of trees are these? Uh, I think they're bears. Bears, 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 bears. We got some bears. I'm pretty sure he just summoned a demon here. As we arrived to the crest, we arrived to another seemingly uneventful conclusion. That's it, we hiked all this way and we're finally here at, well, it's not really a pond anymore, is it? I think that's just grass. But that's when looking at this footage now, I found another gem. <coughs> not that gem. Dude, update your system, gosh. Come on. You can also picture me in the God's office. How many years has it been since you updated your system? I can just take a still from the video. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> okay. Wow, well, you're the most boring. Nestle, snack that smile back to your face. Some okay, girls want diamond rings, but I don't want anything but oh, you, baby. Back to my bag. This is a good place to camp out. Imagine putting a nice little cute couple tent right here. Yeah. Having vigorous sex? <laughs> exactly my thought. Looking at this footage brings me back to my initial point that I made like a minute ago, so I'm not going to restate it, but basically, I was looking at it all wrong. Yeah, the footage was goofy and stupid, but I was having a good time with friends I'm thankful for. And isn't that reward enough? Let's remember at the time, though, I was still searching for content desperately. Yes, ma'am. We got a cool Cobra? You want me to take a cool vlog of some pictures? I'm so down. Oh, you wanted me to take a cool pictures of the log, not the not vlog. Honestly, worth it. Angelo was searching for something too. It definitely wasn't content though. And I definitely am not hopeful for what he's going to find. Lana, where's Angelo? Uh, I don't know. He's, wait. He's that wild creature. Why can he, like, not walk up? Why can't he walk fast enough? You couldn't walk fast enough? Mm, was, was he not keeping our pace? He wasn't. He was, like, way back. Actually, ready? Yeah, the back of the left one. I... Don't know if he's gonna get down. I never saw Angelo after this moment. I'm pretty sure he died. Lena, I want you to just like describe your fear of bears and also like rate it on the Mel's Briggs scale of personality. A A A. Mine is ENFP. A A Ron. That's not even close to my name. And that's it. That's what I've been doing for the last eight months of my life. There are no more words left to be said. There's no satisfaction for the three failed vlogs that I had. Well, no satisfaction till now. I'll see you with my eyes. Where's the lake? Here, over the hill. I forgot to take the lens cap off again. Dang it. Tell me.